Aloha friends. Aloha friends. Here's Danny. This is my daughter Danny. Um, I'm here to show you guys the scent smell. I don't know what, what we're gonna call this, Danny. But um, I have I have a confession to make. Um, as a sensei consultant, I receive these small testers in compared to like the party testers. And friends, I cannot read them. So I have my kids every time I receive new ones as transition sets. I get my kids to help me because I can't read. I can't read it. Okay. So Danny was uh, separating it for me, and it's in like seven categories, right, Danny? Uh -huh. Okay. So we have the seven categories are categories are um, the new release, which is this one. New release. New release are always new release. It it's never been out before, so it's always brand spanking new. With that being said, I am here as a smell tester along with Danny with my cup of chai <laughs> and um, friends someone's gonna ask because everybody loves my blue cup uh, I got this at the TJ Maxx like years ago okay so Danny was very nice and nice enough to smell it for me so I'm gonna put up like a couple separate videos okay where are we Okay, so Danny has separated it and we had actually gone ahead with the new release but then I stopped and said that you know what let's go ahead and show our friends for our first scent um, we'll go ahead and show you guys the rest of them but for the new release we've actually gone through them and if you guys look at my um, my catalog the this is how I separated them the X means I didn't really care for it or Danny didn't really care for it the one star means it was good and then the two star was our favorite right uh -huh. okay so let's go ahead and start with um, anything you choose there Danny mm. let's start with homestead holiday okay homestead holiday is this so go ahead and take a smell mm. what do you think you like it okay so Let's smell this. Homestead Holiday is blood orange and cinnamon freshened with a fur needle. And I like it. It's a good, it's a good fall scent. Could even go all the way to uh, winter. So I would actually burn this from September all the way up to New Year's. Okay, so that's really good. I'm actually going to put a two star on that one. Okay, so let's separate that. Go ahead. And next one. This one is apple cinnamon sticks. Okay, apple cinnamon sticks right here. Apple peel, spice, white pumpkin, and a touch of oak. Mm, it's kind of good. Kind of good? Okay. Hmm. You can really smell the, the fall scent in this one. Mm -hmm. You can really smell the apple and the spice. So it's a good good scent if you guys really like your fall scent um, I'm actually gonna put a star on that one. all right so for the apple cinnamon sticks I went ahead and put two two stars because I think um, that one was really good this one's hugging a mug hugging a mug I think that was Danny's favorite huh uh -huh. yeah that was my favorite. so sorry I I was painting and there's a black paint on my fingernail oh hugging a mug Huh, curl up with chocolate, hazelnut, and cookie dough. And friends, uh, this was very popular with the um, when when Sensi releases a scent during the summer. They have it over at the family reunion, and um, this was very popular uh, when the consultants were smelling the scents. They said, "Hug in a mug. Look out for that one." And I guarantee you guys, it's mm, smells really good. So I'm definitely gonna order that one. Two stars means we're gonna order it, right, Danny? Mm -hmm. Okay. So which one's that one? Orange clove pomander. Pomander. Okay. Orange clove pomander is ginger, clove, and vanilla make for a spicy sweet treat. Mmm. I put um half star and a half, but it's a good scent for fall. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um. I can really I can smell the clove. I can really smell the clove, and I'm not much of a clove. Fan, so maybe that's why I just put half one and a half but it does smell like fall so it's a good scent for the fall actually when Danny and I really smelled this the first time they all smell so good all of them but we we have to break it down into our favorites okay which one's that one 
Sweet cream spice. Sweet cream spice, which is right here. Vanilla mm. bean and nutmeg swirled with frothy milk. I love this one. Mmm, that's Danny's favorite, okay. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, that's my favorite too. It's just like hugging a mug. It's just, it's, it's really good. So I put two stars on that one. Vanilla bean and nutmeg swirled with frothy milk. You can smell the vanilla bean and a bit of the nutmeg, but you can really smell like the sweet, it's sweet cream spice. It's really good, huh? Mm -hmm. it's okay. Kind of, it kind of, it's kind of like a warm scent. Oh, mm, kind of like a warm scent, she said. Okay. Which one's that one? Gingerbread donut. Gingerbread donut, right here. Heavenly golden gingerbread spice donut and vanilla bean. Mm, I like that one too. You like that one? Mm. Okay. Oh yes. Oh, this would smell so good. Uh, before your friends come over and you just put this smell, they think that you're baking something in the oven, huh? Hmm, very good, yes. That receives two stars. Yep, two stars. Next one is love and happiness. Love and happiness is glazed chestnut, vanilla, and sugarcane define temptation. Is it how it how was it? It was good. Ooh, I put a one star because Danny said it was good. But to me, I'm more of a clean fruity scent, and this is a clean fruity scent that you don't expect into the fall and winter catalog. You would think this was, this would come from spring and summer because you can you can really smell the sweetness to it, huh? Where, that's where the sugar cane is. But yet it has, there's something there that makes it fall. So that's really good. I'm going to actually get that one. I'm going to put a two star on that one because it's sweet. Okay. The next one is holly berry cinnamon. Okay. Holly berry cinnamon is sweet. Is it cases? Cases? Hmm. Spice with clove leaf and juniper berry. You like it? Oh, I put two star and I said it's perfect for a Christmas scent. Yes. It smells like we're in a um, Christmas tree farm, huh? Uh -huh. With, with um, Christmas tree farm with, um, with, um, because I can smell the clove. So with like, I don't know, like cinnamon. Oh, it oh yeah, have cinnamon kind of. Peppermint. Mmm. Kind of. No matter what, it smells good. Holly berry cinnamon. Next one is painted leaves. Okay. Painted leaves is wander through blue spruce, red maple, and golden woods. Mm -hmm. We put an X on that one the first time. Yeah. We didn't like it. It's okay. It's okay. It smells like fall, right? Uh -huh. You know what it smells like to me? It smells like someone wearing boots with scarves and sweater. Mm -hmm. You know, it just smells very folly. It smells, it's not bad. It's not bad, but it's n not one of Danny's favorites. So the next one is toasted coconut amaretto, mm. I think. Amaretto? amaretto? Toasted coconut amaretto is almond, praline cream, and just a hint of anise. What do you think? I like this one. Yep, we put two star. Okay. Oh, it smells so good, Danny. Mmm, yes, it smells really good. Um, you can really smell, you can smell the anise in there because anise is a very strong scent even though there's just a hint of it, it says. It smells good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a, that's a definite keeper. That deserves a two star. I think we put two mm -hmm. star. The next one is glacial ice. Glacial ice is a touch of wild berry cooled by frosty mistletoe. Mm. You like it? Mm-hmm. Yes, I put a one star there because it wasn't... It's good, actually. Two star. Mm -hmm. That's a two star. Um, it's, it's just like... Um, where was it? Sweet... Where was it? Sweet cream or love and happiness? Where we said that it was... Um, like a spring summer scent but yet it has a smell of a fall to it mm -hmm. so glacial ice it's clean scent 
but then it gives you that pop of the Christmas snow. Oh yeah. Okay. The next one is spiced fruit cider. Cider? Cider. Okay. You like it? Mm. Yeah, okay. We put two star in that one the first time. Uh, spice fruit cider is pomegranate juice and sweet orange simmered with cinnamon stick. Mmm. I like that one. I like that one too. It's sweetness to it and you can smell the cinnamon and the sweet orange and then a smell of juice. Exactly what it says. Uh, it smells really good. Mm -hmm. So, so far the sweet scents are sweet cream, spicy fruit, uh, spice fruit, the glacial ice, and then love and happiness. The next one is vanilla oud. Mm. Mm. Vanilla oud? Mm -hmm. Okay. Vanilla oud is sweet vanilla grounded by leather and earthy oud wood. Mm. Never heard of oud before. Have you? No. Oh, it smells good. Mm -hmm. It does smell good. Mm. Um, you can smell the vanilla in there and a bit of leather. So it's, it's like a grandma's house. It's like coming to her house on Christmas weekend, waiting for Christmas morning to open presents. And it's just the smell of the holiday surrounded by family and mo cocoa, cocoa. Yeah, so that's a good um, scent for family gatherings. It just smells very homey. The next one is Quiet Grove. Quiet Grove. Quiet Grove is a soft spell of bergamot, jasmine, and sandalwood. Mm. Yep, we put a two star in there the first time. Oh, it smells so good. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like winter. Yep, winter. Um, with that little bit of a jasmine, you can smell that fruity scent. You can, it smells really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. And then last one for the new release. The last one is Pretty and Plum. Pretty and Plum. Pretty and Plum is red plum, gets pastry perfect with black coconut and sweet cream. Uh, Danny it loves smells it. like hug in a mug. Oh, hug in a mug? Oh, yes. Oh, where's hugging a mug? Let's put that together. She said it smells like hugging a mug. So open that one. Okay. It does, but that one has, um, you can smell the hazelnut and the chocolate in that one. Mm -hmm. And this one you can smell the, hmm, they both smell good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Did you like testing them out? Okay, we're going to move on to fall and winter and then holiday. So I just told Danny that we got to do it a little bit faster. Okay, so which one are we doing, Danny? Fall and winter. Okay, fall and winter. Okay, let's um, brand new scent for us. We haven't smelt it. Smelt it. Okay, go ahead, Danny. All right, so she needed help opening it. Okay, go ahead. The first one is Farm Stand Pumpkin. Mm-hmm. Mm, I like that one. You like that one? Okay. Ooh. It smells really good. You can smell a bit of the cinnamon and apple and pumpkin. Yeah. It smells very fall. Perfect for fall. So let's go put... For now, we are going to put one star and a half because it does smell good. But we want to know what we're comparing it to. The next one is lavender and white balsam. Mmm. Lavender and white balsam is lavender freshened by wintry white balsam and crisp amber. Mm, I like that one. You like it? It's like a sweet kind of Oh, smell. yes. Sweet fall. Mm, you can really smell the lavender in this one. And it's... For something that's strong, it's yet clean, refreshing scent. I'm going to put a two star in that one. I really like that one. Okay. The next one is um, Cider Mill. Cider Mill is brings together fresh apples, crushed pumpkin, and simmering spices for a cozy autumn treat. Mm, it's kind of pumpkin smell. Mm-hmm. Yep, you can really smell the pumpkin and apples. It's like um, cooked apples. Ooh. Spices. It's funny how they name it because... See how it says apples simmering? 
you think that you are putting it um, over a stove. Mm. You know what it really smells like is that um, that clove orange peel um, scent that you make and put it over the stove and let it simmer for hours. That's what it smells like. The next one is cashmere pear. Cashmere pear. Where's that one at? Um, here. Slip into sensual white amber, Madagascar vanilla, silky pear, and warm red ginger. A blended, a blend as smooth and luxurious as fine spun cashmere. I like this one. You do? Mm -hmm. Yes. Danny's right. Mm -hmm. Smells really good. Very fall. Perfect yes. fall. I'm going to put two star. Two star on that one, Danny. Oh, what about the um, the cider? I think we put two star on that one as well. That was really good. Cider mill. The next one is pumpkin marshmallow. Pumpkin marshmallow is sticky sweet marshmallow spooned onto fresh baked pumpkin and wrapped in graham cracker crust. It's kind of good. Mm, like, you can really smell like pumpkin. Like when you uh, go at a carnival and you like smell... Like, it's like a pumpkin pie smell uh -huh. pumpkin yeah pie. yeah it's okay I'll just put a one star what do you think mm -hmm. okay Danny agrees one star if you like the smell of pumpkin that smells like pumpkin puree mm -hmm. the next one is very snowy spruce very snowy spruce Bree right. sorry friends we had to change batteries okay the next one Danny is very snowy spruce. Okay, very snowy spruce is breathe in fresh forest air, balsam, spruce, and cedar branches. Embrace the warmth of amber and woody pine cones. Mm. What'd you think? This was okay. Oh, Danny doesn't care much for it, but I like it for a very winter, um, December yeah, scent. Yeah, December. Yeah, you can smell like the, like the pine trees with... With the musky or the, hmm, the cedar. I think you can really smell the cedar now. But that's a Christmas scent. It smells good though. I'm going to put two stars on that one for Christmas. Okay. Next one. The next one is cranberry garland. Cranberry garland is a sweet tart cranberry grounded by sage and earthy pine cones. Mm. You like that one? Uh-huh. It's kind of like a juice. Mm, you can really smell the cranberry on that one. Yeah. Like a cranberry juice, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's really nice. Mm -hmm. I'll put a one star on that one. The next one is Barak Barragmot. I can't I can't read that one. Okay, la Let's see. Where's that one at? Hmm. On the back, it says cashmere pear. Oh, yeah, that's cashmere pear. What is it saying on the front, though? Oh. That's weird. Well. Oh, let me see. Baragma and solar driftwood or something. Oh. Okay, she's right. So this one, okay, smell it. So that has to be the... Mm-hmm. That's cashmere pear. Uh -huh. See, it's but it's a different, different covering. Hmm. Okay. I like that one. Next one is honey pear. And the, oh wait, cashmere pear is slip into sensual white amber, right? Mm. Silky pear and warm red ginger. A blend as smooth and luxurious as pine spun cashmere. We already smelled that one. Oh. Yeah. Okay, let's go on to the next one. So honey pear cider is the scent of pure autumn, bliss, fresh, juicy pear, and sweet honey together with subtle hints of spices. Mmm. Mmm. Smells good. good. Yeah. You can smell a lot of spice on this one. Very fall. Which one is that one? The honey pear? I would put two star on that one. Okay, two star on the honey pear. The next one is pumpkin roll. Pumpkin roll. 
Okay, so smell pumpkin roll. Where's pumpkin roll? Right there. Pumpkin roll is creamy pumpkin pie filling surrounded with yellow cake, pecans, butter, and spice. It's like, yeah, I think it's spice. Hmm. I can smell the cooked pumpkin. It's not like the raw pumpkin puree of the other one, cider mill. It smells good. It's subtle though for pumpkin. Mm -hmm. I say one star. One star, yeah. The next one is cinnamon bear. Cinnamon bear? Mm hmm. Cinnamon bear is crisp, spicy cinnamon, reminiscent of red hot candy with a touch of cloves. Yeah, you can really smell the red hot. Oh, yeah. It's like you just open up a box of Red Hots. Mmm, Grammy's gonna like that one. Yeah. Okay. The next one is... Oh, I'm gonna put a one star on that one because you can actually... Maybe two star if you really like that cinnamon scent. Okay. The next one is Cedar Cider. Cedar Cider? Cedar Cider? Cedar cider, right? An autumn medley of the reddest apples, cinnamon sticks, and vanilla beans nestled among fragrant white cedar branches. Mm. Very fall. Strong, strong scent. You can smell the cinnamon and the, um, the cedar in that one. Okay, three more. Next I'll put a one star on that one. The next one is blackberry orange marmalade. Mmm. Orange marmalade and blackberry jam over sugar crystals. Mmm. Very sweet. Mmm, yeah. <coughs> yeah, um, you can really smell the blackberry on this one. Mm -hmm. Jam, yeah. Too sweet for me. Um, it kind of smells like the sweet pea and vanilla. Mmm. One star on that one. This <coughs> one is everything nice. So everything nice is sugar and spice and everything nice, deep caramel and swirls of butter with roasted pumpkin and glazed pecans. You can really smell the um Oh yes, this is a good fall scent. Mm -hmm. oh. <coughs> Very good. It's strong. Yeah. I would I would definitely get this one. That's a two two star. I like this one. Yeah. This that's one. a very good, if you're going to have one false scent, uh oh, there's a bee, well, um, that's a really good one. Okay, last one. Peppermint Rush. Okay, Peppermint Rush is peppermint, sweet, vanilla, and, and an accord of freshly fallen snow. You can really smell that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this, um, this smells like candy cane. Yeah, candy cane. Mm hmm it Smells like candy cane, so it's a good Christmas scent. And you know what? That's it. We're going to put these two videos together of the new release and the fall and winter. And then we'll do another video of the rest of the scent to give you guys a really good idea of what the new fall and winter scents are. Mm -hmm. Alright, so we'll see you guys soon. Watch our next video. Mahalo. Mahalo.